This isn't just any sweet, it's a special adult treat with a nation twist. Why is this gem still undiscovered? You can't find it anywhere. The first time I tried it, I knew that I had to share it with you. Trust me, one bite and you will be craving more. Start by cutting some parchment paper to fit your mold. Stick it in and give it a light brush of cooking oil to keep things from sticking. Not the best at cutting? Don't swear it. I'm in the same boat. Grab 200 gram of sugar, toast it into a frying pan over medium heat. You also need 100 ml of cream, 20 gram of butter, and 50 ml of bourbon whiskey for that extra kick. Now there's some debate on whether to stir the sugar. This time I'm going to stir it. When you see those lovely bubbles forming, turn down the heat to avoid burning. Keep swirling the pan gently to make sure the sugar doesn't scorch. If it does, it's game over. Low and slow is the name of the game. Once the sugar has reached a nice syrupy consistency, remove it from the heat and add in 100 ml of cream. Watch it bubble up. This is the fun part. Turn the heat back on and stir it 20 gram of butter. Everyone's kitchen setup is different, so I can't give you exact cooking time. If it's too runny, you'll get a sauce. If it's too thick, you'll have a break. Aim for the sweet spot. Just before you finish, pour in 50 ml of bourbon whiskey. This adds a rich depth you won't forget. Then add 50 ml of soy sauce. Any soy sauce works here. If you want a bold flavor, go for more. You want people to say, what's the flavor? Now pour the mixture into your prepared mold. Sprinkle some salt and sesame seeds on top and let it cool down. Pop it into the fridge for 2-3 hours. Once it's set, take it out and slice it into bite-sized pieces. Package it however you like. See you next time.